course you can get out too. Sheepers, what did you think I was going to do? See how dark he is? This is not your normal raccoon. This is it's a cross. It's a cross between an otter. Otters have beautiful dark fur like that. This is an otter coon. It's a raptor. He doesn't have a leg. Look at that. No wonder he's dead. Look how rich that fur is. Rich. There's a bill rich right now. Now, somebody was saying that baby raccoon's eyes. Oh, his eyes are open. Hello. Were you sleeping? Okay, they've got their mask is not fully developed if they're not if they're young. Look how his nose is so turned up. He's got an upturned little nose. Upturned nose. Da, 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 da. Anyway, I don't think his raccoon face is very developed. But this guy's pretty big to be a baby. Look at that tail. They're usually light brown. Like the darkest is usually the color of the light stuff there. Did you know, now this is a little bit of trivia, that when you get killed, not you, I mean a dead animal, when something gets killed, rigor mortis sets in and everything's really stiff. Well, after, I think it's either 12 or 24 hours, Rigor mortis stops and it's no longer stiff. Do you know that? Like, look at this guy. So he's, he just feels a little bit soft there. See, he's got the right color underneath. Uh oh. Oh no. Now I'm on the wrong side of the road. Well, Please don't park in the road. <sighs> well, I'll have to go back to my car. They'll understand. As soon as they see the dead raccoon and my skirt, they'll know it's me. Do you know what I was thinking? I was thinking, wouldn't it be fun to paint my car? Like, I mean, paint some hours on it or something? It's my old bomb. I don't know how long it's going to live, really. Suppose if I cross the border with a car that's got big, giant, yellow flower petals on it. Customs probably, you know, they'll probably, what's the word? Inspect it. They'll rip it apart. You know they don't have to put it back together. They can completely disassemble your car and leave it in a thousand pieces at the border. Well, see, this is where it got to be a cross between an otter and a beaver. See, the otters live in here. I mean, not an otter and a beaver. An otter and a raccoon. I am right in the middle, aren't I? Anyway, this is the home of the otter, beaver, cro otter, raccoon cross. That would be genetic modification, only they do it themselves. And I have proof. That's the missing link, that one right there. That is the link between otters and raccoons. So they should have just come to me. And we, they want to know, they think that we all evolved from one little tiny step. So, if we got to go from a raccoon to an otter, well, you know, there's got to be the cross. And they never even think about that. They don't say, you know, well, how come now? Look, we have, look, I have proof. Yep, there it is. That is the otter coon cross. Of course, there's another cross that we know about, which brings to mind other things other than evolution. Yes. Oh, I don't want to stir up discontent. I know what I believe. I know what's true. My daughter used to call our church. She said that, or she had this little cartoon, and it was the the church of I of I am the only true church, or something. Every church thinks they're the only true church. But I know that mine is. You know, I don't know about all the rest of you, but... <laughs> In 450 meters, turn right Let's on Sheridan Rapids Road, then turn left.